It's loud, there's danger involved, it's an upcoming sport, it's only going to get bigger. Timber sports is so unique. It's the original extreme sport, it's dangerous. You've got the swing of the axes between your legs. It's so hard to get that perfect log cut that it just makes you want to come back for more and more to try and improve each time. Don't get me wrong, I like to win. <laughs> but I just like the, the camaraderie, really, and that's what drives me. I never thought I'd be doing the steel timber sports. I'm going to you know, push myself. It's going to be just so exhilarating to be in amongst the crowd, have people cheering along. A lot of adrenaline goes through you when you are up on stage. I think this year I'm just going to stay completely focused on where my first few hits are going to go. You know the muscle memory, you know it's there. All you've got to think about is just how you're going to cut the log. You know you can do it. It's just about doing it then and reading the wood. This year I think it's going to be pretty close. This year it's open to anyone. Uh, there's so many things that can go right or go wrong on the day. Yeah, the target for this year is definitely to uh, get on that top step of the podium and finally get there. I've come second and third now a few times, so I want to get to that next level. So before uh, each competition, yeah, I do get a little bit nervous, but I use that to fuel the adrenaline and psych myself up ready for it. When everything goes as it should, it's one of the best feelings you'll get. Um, it's just all that training and effort coming together and it's quite a cutthroat thing. You know, at the last minute, it can be millimetres that can make the difference. Anyone who wants to get involved, then reach out to either a local club or get on the Steel website. Have a look when the next training camps are, you won't regret it. It's a great sport to be a part of and you will enjoy it.